It's a more lifestyle diseases, hypertension, nor the definition. This is just high blood pressure. Okay, that was a very ugly line. This is an illness where the blood pressure in your arteries is just, it's constantly high. And arteries are the blood vessels that carry oxygen-rich blood into your body. Blood pressure is the force of blood that pushes up against the walls of the blood vessels. So diseases of the heart and circulatory system. So circulatory system diseases. This is about the heart and the vessel system. But cardiovascular diseases, this is a group of diseases that involve the heart, the blood vessels, the arteries, and the veins. Okay. So the heart and circulatory system. Just know the difference between the two. You don't have to study the definition, but have a strong reading knowledge of it. Uh, STIs, including HIV and AIDS. And these are spread by the transfer of infected organisms from person to person during, well, this. We don't say the word because we don't want to get flagged. So bits and pieces of STIs with the focus on HIV. You've covered it so many times, you know, just being a South African life orientation learner over the years. Uh, TB, tuberculosis. This is an infectious disease caused by the Mycobacterium tuberculosis bacterium. They said bacterium twice. Okay, so it is spread through an airborne in, through airborne infection droplets. So just someone coughing near you. When infectious people cough, even sneeze, or maybe if they spit, they move TB bacteria into the air. And people living with HIV are at much, much, much greater risk of developing TB because their immune system's already uh, compromised. So they can't withstand the TB bacteria. It's kind of like COVID. If you had comorbidities, like you had hypertension, um, you know, high blood pressure, or you know, you had HIV, and you have got diabetes, it will hit you a bit harder than someone without comorbidities, like underlying health issues. So yeah, bits and pieces here about hypertension, diseases of the heart and circulatory system, STIs, and TB all falling under the lifestyle diseases section in life orientation. Okay, let's keep it going.